Welcome back to Life with Feet. I just took an incredible flight in that beautiful creature back there called the Albatross. Maybe you've heard of it from the movie The Expendables. Uh, yes, that's that same exact airplane. And it was so cool to go up and not only be in the plane, but sit in the pilot command seat and fly for a little bit. And I'm here inside the Albatross and I'm going to get a little tour about all the different things that are really kind of cool in here. So it this is, is cool. Mike here, and Mike is the one who flew the plane this morning and invited me to take over his seat for a little bit. <laughs> and she did a great job. So can you tell us a little bit about this? Yeah, this is an HU-16 Albatross. It was used by the Coast Guard, the Navy, and the Air Force uh, for search and rescue missions. Um, this particular one was actually ordered by the Coast Guard but delivered to the Navy. And so they're just a little different configurations, that's about it. But it was basically, uh, there were stretchers on both sides of this for the patients after they rescued them. Okay. And the door here had a platform. We have a platform. We use it as a swim platform now. So you could get down on the water to actually get somebody in who was injured. Got it. Okay. And you could also go out that door if you needed to. Mm-hmm. It has interesting features like these windows, which are... You can stick your head out there and see straight down if you need to. So if you're getting close to something or somebody, you can do that. Okay. It has little places on the side here, little doors that open. They fly past uh, their target, fire a flare, and then circle back around and find the flare. Oh. So things are just different. Wow, yeah. that's neat. Okay. Uh, as we always say, every airplane can land in the water, but we can take off again. That's ah, the difference, yeah. That's a big difference. Right. Okay. So there's uh, 14 of these that we know of now in existence. And uh, we took Jessica this morning out to Lake Conroe. Let her get, she got a little wet today. And uh, that's always the most fun of having a, a flying boat. Yes. Yeah. Oh, thank you so much, Mike. That was one of, once in a lifetime opportunity. Thank you so much. Oh, no. Very Thanks. glad to have you here in Conroe. Okay. Thank okay. you. Take Bye. care. Thanks. All right. Thanks, Thanks. guys. Yeah. Adios. I still can't believe what I did yesterday. That was such a treat. I showed up at an airport to help with the Challenge Air event, which was actually supposed to help children with disabilities, and they gave me this great opportunity to go flying in that beast of an airplane, the Albatross. It was pretty incredible, flying and landing on the water, but what was also cool was at the end, when we came in to land, I had the opportunity to look around the plane and one of the things I really wanted to do was to climb into that hatch that has a little opening next to the nose of the airplane. I mean, how many airplanes have that? It was like climbing into a submarine, but 10 times better because it's an actual airplane. The challenge was though, you actually have to crawl with your hands and knees. And obviously I don't have arms and hands. So for me, trying to get into the hatch was a challenge and it wasn't very easy, so Mike, the pilot, came up with this idea of using a little scooter with wheels to wheel me underneath the control panel so I could crawl into that hatch. I popped out of that airplane, and it was so cool to see the airplane from that angle, looking around and being that high off the ground. That was one of the most incredible airplane experiences. Don't ever pass up an a, don't ever pass up out on an opportunity to go see an airplane, go to an air show, or do something aviation related. It'll be so much fun, and I had such a wonderful time yesterday. Not only inspiring children with disabilities through Challenge Air, but to be a part of this whole energy and excitement with flying. Thanks for watching. Please like and subscribe, or go to Patreon.com/toetalks and subscribe. Thanks. I'm in.